so good to see all of you. Um, when Putin decided to invade Ukraine, he thought that he would be dividing us. He was wrong. Today is a historic day. Finland is joining NATO, and NATO is more stronger than ever. Canada was the first country to ratify Finland and Sweden's accession. Um, we call on Turkey and Hungary to ratify uh, without delay. And we believe with Finland and soon to be Sweden's accession, we will have a very strong alliance and we will be able to deal with the biggest challenges that uh, NATO has faced in many years. Donc, je vais le dire maintenant en français. Um, lorsque le président Poutine a décidé d'envahir l'Ukraine, à l'époque, il pensait qu'il allait être en mesure de nous diviser. Mais il a perdu son pari. La réalité, c'est qu'aujourd'hui, c'est un jour historique. Un jour historique où la Finlande se joint à l'OTAN. Et le Canada a été le premier pays à ratifier l'accession de la Finlande et de la Suède à l'OTAN. Et nous appelons la Turquie et la Hongrie à ratifier sans délai l'accession de la Suède. Notre objectif, bien entendu, est de faire en sorte de encore et toujours renforcer l'alliance donc avec la Finlande et sous peu, on l'espère, la Suède, nous allons être en mesure de euh, gérer les défis contemporains de l'OTAN. Merci. If he really wants peace, Putin needs to get out of Ukraine. Period. We've been clear on that and will continue to say. And meanwhile, we, uh, we believe that this is a very important day, a, a, a day that we should all celebrate because uh, as a country, uh, Finland is uh, a, a plus to the alliance. And for Canada, why it is it important? It is also an Arctic nation. And we want to make sure that as Arctic nations are um, uh, addressing uh, some of the security challenges that we're facing, we need to make sure that Finland and Sweden are at the table in, and with the NATO. Why NATO is now becoming safer with Finland, while at the same time it's also extending its direct border with Russia with the accession of Finland? NATO is, uh, is uh, not against Russia and, uh, and, and NATO has not been... Uh, how can I say, countries around uh, the table at NATO have been supporting of Ukra supportive of Ukraine, and Ukraine uh, has uh, important needs that we're there to support. And in that sense, if Russia wants peace, and if China wants peace, they need to, Russia needs to get out of Ukraine, and China needs to say to Russia to get out of Ukraine. Thank you.